Welcome, welcome, welcome back. It's your host, J. Byron Reacts. We are back with another video. Today, we are back with episode two of What If Season 2. Today's episode is called What If Peter Quill Attack Earth's Mightiest Heroes? And I'm excited to watch this one. You know, we're getting my boy P Peter Quill in here. We're getting, from what I've seen in the, in the, little, in the little trailers and stuff, we're getting we're getting Bucky, aka the Winter Soldier. We're getting, we're getting Hank. We're getting T'Chaka. We're getting, we're getting Giant Size Man, aka Goliath. And it's gonna be a good episode. I'm excited for this. I'm excited to see what the premise of this episode is about. Last episode was really, really good. It, it, it revolved around Nebula, you know solving the death of of yandu and her being portrayed by the nova, by the nova Corps, and that was you know the blade runner vibes of that it was really really cool i enjoyed that a lot and i'm excited to, to see what's you know what's gonna happen in this episode i'm excited so without further ado we're gonna get into the episode let's get into it Marvel Studios presents What If? Why is it pixelated? Commander, you have eyes on the target. Barely, it's moving. Oh, look at this. Age, we cannot allow it to enter USS base. Copy that. Weapon shot. Fire at will. Okay, so we back with Captain Carter. Yeah. Oh. Where? New York, 1988. Oh! What in the world? They look like ego shit. Well, it probably is. Yep, that's ego shit. And there's Peter. Is that a kid? Not just any. Now there's the watcher. Once called home, and the entire universe along with it. Oh snap! So this is if he had his powers. Oh lord. Space. <laughs> Guide through these vast new realities. To ponder the question. To the question. What if? If. What if? Episode two. Peter Quill attacks Earth's mightiest heroes. Avengers were dispatched to abduct Peter Quill from his home world. Will's captor couldn't bring himself to turn him over and chose to raise him as his own. His own. Yep, Yandu. Universe. Yandu never had his change of heart, so he turned Peter over to his father, the Celestial. Mmm. It's ego. Yeah. Won't be needing these anymore, Peter. To remake the universe in his image, and with his son now at his side. Nah, this one, he's gonna be a, he's gonna be a mega level. Yeah, he's gonna be a problem. Steps across dozens of nearby solar systems. This Peter Quill gonna be a problem. A real problem. Within 24 hours of his arrival. And I thought my kid was a pain in the ass. Tony has spunk. Person on Earth who can stop him. Not one person working alone, but a team made up. Oh, look, it's old Howard. Garbage doesn't really play outside of MTV. This boy has- mm. Um, there's no vegetable. The potato chips are- I was hope. Be a scientist. And you're supposed to like potato chips. I like potato chips. A young Henry Hank Pym. Hank, please, don't hang up. Go on the take. Listen, if you don't want to talk to me, that's fine. We have some beef. Turn on the TV. Hank and Howard has some beef. Send the plane. One step ahead of you. Oh. Then so we don't get we don't get Janet. No, no. Used to work, sweet. Please, no. 
Things must be real bad if they had the balls to call us in. Foster! Great. Now I know it's... Oh, Lawrence Fishburne. Hank? What's the matter? Didn't want to spring for a sitter. You know damn well I don't have anyone to... Hold up, please. I'm Yorma, King T'Chaka of the African Kingdom of Wakanda. They don't typically involve themselves... Oh, you hear the theme? Let's hear that Wakanda theme. Your Highness, it's a pleasure. Your father was a great ally to us during the war. Pretty well. Hey, how'd the commies snag an invite? Gorbachev wanted the target contained before. Oh, so this the this the Avengers. The Winter Soldier, uh -oh. the world's most deadly assassin. There he is. Oh snap! I heard the rumors, but even if they're true, the man we knew is long gone. Oh snap! To fry. I never thought what it would be like if, you know, Peggy ran into into Bucky at, when he was the Winter Soldier. It's a long way from the Mojave Desert. Not in my ride. Marvel. Wendy Lawson, you Wendy Lawson, yeah. It's not. It's Kree Star Force. What? Long story. Uh and she's a Kree. Silent but deadly. Good to see you. And you're gonna be the crusty guy. <laughs> I was just- Not the crusty guy. Tony Island, oh, there. Quite a show. Now he's really a problem right now. <laughs> Peter, calm down. That raccoon. From my pet. That's resemblance of Rocket. Leaving, your highness. You would think the leader of a technological superpower that masquerades as a third world country would appreciate that. I don't know if that's a red panda or just a raccoon. At the perimeter. Whoa. Remember you maxing out. Oh, this is cool as heck, dude. If only we were able to see this in Ant Man and the Wasp. I have eyes on the target. He appears see Goliath in action. And the boy. Are you sure you do not want any backup? Ah, I'm great. I love this. What's the matter, kid? What? Something bugging you? Huh. The banter. Between everybody in the team, I miss that kind of stuff, dude. A minute to crack it. Oh, snap. <clears throat> I mean, if Peter was gonna use his. Oh! They destroyed his animal. My young friend. Oh, snap. Nah, this is fire. Wait a minute. I got him. Look, oh, no. look. If, if you was gonna have Peter use his powers finally, Ego, you could at least train him how to use it and hone in his powers instead of being reckless. Blows, there won't be a planet left to save. Oh. Oh. Not the Avengers theme. Thanks, big guy. Anytime. Oh. Guys. Love it. Love it. Anyone have a plan? I've got a plan. Oh yeah, this episode is fun. This is a fun episode. Okay, let's go. <laughs> oh. He is not gonna let y'all leave. Oh! Is that my boy? <laughs> my boy Thor! It's my boy Thor. Heaven Halen. I'm Van what? I love seeing my boy Thor. Ugh. Until this realm, Earth, was all that remained. I've been forgetting Thor is like 1,500 years old. I don't know how he old he is now, his essence on the planet. but the right here, I recovered around, Earth's on my way here from a place. I'd say 1,500. That's how he's doing it. He's consuming these planets. The seedlings are the fuse of egos. Problem solved. Wrong. The seedling is protected by a veil of cosmic energy. Only I like this design for Thor better than the one, the design we got last season. Hey! He don't know it. Just me. Kinda awkward. 
Who sung? Not hoping Peter meeting as kids. Well, if I still had mine, I'd probably be doing the same. You know. Yeah. Missouri. <laughs> My dad said you were an alien. Dude, feed me a corn dog. He's have alien have Taryn. Babe deck. I'm just trying to get home. But you're trying to get home and you're destroying stuff. It's not cool. Containment facility. Where are my particles? And where's Hope? I got my hammer over there. My mail here? It's over there. Mm. Now she shrunk. Hope. <laughs> and thank you, Dad. Your mom's. Look, it's a long ride to Missouri. And she'd be. Right, you might want to listen to some music on the ride there. Hope. I owe you one. Hope! I was just trying to help him get home. Home? Like his home world? No. no. He says he's like a weird alien space god or something. Yeah. Yeah. The absentee father. I get that enough from my own son. Sweetie, we really need to find your friend. I mean, you barely dare, Howard. I will find the boy and destroy him and the seedling myself. Hey, lightning boy. Uh, Thor. Miss your buddy. Thing going on here, mustache man. To see to it that the Not mustache man. We can't just let you take him. We need to study him. We need to kill him. <laughs> this is like the <laughs> even without the seedling. Well, what do you know? He oh. speaks. Right, but to say you're finally speaking, Becky. The last his logic is sound. So long as the boy lives this planet. <clears throat> sure. That's right. You're here to do the right thing. Exactly. You know that's what mom would have done. Right. Jen would have did the same thing, Hank. Peter. Peter. Earth. Well, then I guess I'll have to finish what he's- Oh, Lord. Oh. Well, great. Uh, Thunder Guy, is it supposed to be doing this? Right outside. Oh, man. Dang, I can take no, catch no break. Girl was right. Ugh, wouldn't I love to have that printed on a t-shirt? <coughs> Only wins a two-front war by getting out of your enemy's way. Mmm. Fight them both, let them fight each other. Lawson, tell me you've got eyes. Right, right. Picking up some cosmic radiation that's definitely not of this world. You fight. <coughs> you really think a child is going to be so willing to fight his own father? <laughs> what? I think he will be. Are you with me? Now this team up right here is Matt Ireland. Tachaka, Thor, uh taken something from me. Goliath. Get back. Not so long as there is breath in my body. Mm. Oh no. Oh save you by growing and spreading, covering all S what? Till every part of you is me okay there's no way at all we will take it from you oh snap Fire! i will say the animation this season is 10 times better than last season Like it's clean, crisp, everything. No, that was a hard shot. Okay, Peggy. Okay, Thor. Oh no. What? Whoa. Oh, I gotta go bigger. Take him out! Nah, I'm glad the ego in our timeline, the normal timeline, is gone. Cuz. You copy. Now he about to kill the kid? Okay, Hank, look. I can use this gravitational control to hold him down, but I'll need you to subdue him. Target. Hey there, kid. Bucky, no. Hope's dad. She's told me a lot about you. 
everything that's happening. Head. Oh. Come on, let's go. What the heck? Nah. I wish we get to, we got to see Goliath in the MCU room. Well, it's in the MCU, but live action. Live action. I like home anymore. No! No! Fuck you, no! There is no me. Okay, Peggy? I know how you feel, Peter. Since we lost Hope's mom, our... <coughs> Neither have I. The pain, the anger... Oh, wow. You see that kid, all you see is a target. But I see a future. The life he can lead. Right. And the man he knew, the friend he loved, would never... Right. Right. Problem! <laughs> Dark, you... Oh, Lord, what, is, what the frick is about to happen? Please, come join our family. Oh. Say. What's about to happen? Bucky, please. Bucky, 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 Bucky. No, 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 no. Okay. Well. Oh. Y'all gotta get out of there. Not they stumping on his mask. I can't. Yes. Oh, yeah. yeah. Crusty, jump. Not Crusty. I hope you're right about this, kid. All right, let's go. See, he wasn't. He 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 was just trying to be himself. And then his dad got to step in. Seem to have fallen in with the wrong crowd. This is my home, Dad. <coughs> Mom's home. And it can't just let you destroy it. But th that's the more. Yeah, talk that stuff, Peter. Talk that stuff. How did you say that? My mother. You said you loved her. And that I. Well, that's a lie, cause he the one made her sick. You must now, Peter. You killed my mother. Yep. But you, you know you don't have the power to destroy me. You don't know that. A little bit of you will always live inside of me. Hmm. Actually, old man, my mom says I'm a Star Wars. Ugh, talk that stuff, Peter. <laughs> Star Lord. He's still gonna be Star Lord at the end of the day. Ugh. Love that. Oh. You're not splitting the atom. To be honest, yeah. splitting the atom is a lot more intuitive. This is a now, this is a dope episode. Uh, light beer? Ha, how exotic! Another! <laughs> <laughs> Another! Goose! I'm more a dog guy. <laughs> Peter, you don't say no to a free cat. <laughs> right! Well, I'm not a cat person myself. I got a dog. And by the way, his name is Bucky as well. Soldier may be out there, but... I'm pretty sure Bucky Barnes is out there with him. Yeah. <laughs> In Esper to Pi. The boy may have destroyed Ego's corporeal form, but his planet still lives. Hmm. Ones we've lost. So what, Thunder Brother? No invite? Perhaps Thunder Brother. I'm about to start calling Thor that from now on. Th Thunder Brother. <laughs> episode w episode what if season two episode two what a banger episode that was i enjoyed that episode a lot that episode reminded me of you know way back when when we got the first avengers film everybody teaming up for the first time you know the banter between everybody and the love they have like as a group i'm not gonna say family because that's nowhere near no family but this episode was really, really good and really, really fun. I enjoyed it a lot. Enjoyed it a lot. It made me want to watch the first Avengers film because I haven't watched that one in a long time. It made me want to go back and rewatch the first Avengers film when they all were in that circle 
teamed up for the first time and the camera pans around them in the circle like moments for great moments great moments great moments for that 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 whole episode just brought like nostalgia back to me and if y'all wonder why i got excited when i saw thor because thor is one of my favorite one of my all-time favorite characters he's been my favorite i have a lot of favorite characters now since the mcu has been around marvel in general but thor he was my first ever favorite character from the mcu when i was little so to this day he's still my favorite but this episode is really really good I'm excited to get into the next episode. Like, I, I love that Marvel was doing like this nine day thing because, you know, usually they, they drop it week after week. Like say, like say it would be like Wednesday because they usually drop the episodes Wednesday. So Wednesday they drop one episode and next Wednesday they drop another episode. So they basically usually drop it weekly. But now they're dropping it daily for nine days, which is which is cool as heck because it's nine episodes. So I'm excited to see what what next episode is going to be about. I don't know what we're going to get into next episode. I love all the different scenarios we have for each episode, like like with Nebula, the Blade Runner vibes. That's I'm I was I, ever since I've watched the episode, I've been obsessed over the Blade Runner vibes. And we, if we got that in live action with Nebula. trying to be he wasn't trying to like wreck the world his dad was making him do it and he didn't want to do it he just wanted to be a kid like that's all he wanted yeah, all he done I, that's all he wanted to be a kid and then seeing goliath giant sized man orange fish burn back in the back in the mix you know Back as a mortal soldier, I gotta be careful seeing that because my dog's name is Bucky and he's sleeping right here. But this was a good episode. I enjoyed it a lot. I'm not gonna do too much too much talking, I'm not gonna make this this outro long. I just wanted to you know express my feelings about the episode. It was really really good. I enjoyed it a lot. I hope y'all enjoying these reactions and I see y'all enjoyed last episode reaction, so I'm, I, I thank y'all for, you know, you know, watching the reactions and, you know, rocking with your boy. You know, that, 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 that makes me, like, feel happy when I see love for my videos, you know. Because rarely any of my videos get any love, you know. But I'm glad y'all are sticking around, watch, you know, watching my reactions, you know, because, you know, I, I, I could talk about that another time, but. That is it for this video. I hope you guys enjoyed it. If you did, make sure you like, comment, share, and subscribe, and turn on the post notifications so you know.